Alright Dan, uh, tentative start there, first half of the game. Um, I guess we're in the second goal down losing, we're going to try Actually, I, I give a lot of credit to Tri-Cities for that, you know, for, for the start, for the way the game started. Tri-Cities came out extremely fast and physical, they were forechecking hard, put a lot of pressure on us, of course, so that forced us to really elevate our uh, intensity and our, our pace of play. And, uh, you know, you have to give them credit for coming out and getting a really good start. The, the tentative start for me, I don't think it was playing not to lose. I think it was more just needing to be a little bit quicker, a little bit stronger on pucks early in the game, especially versus a team that was coming out desperate like Tri-Cities was. Yeah, last night you said the um, Tri-City Americans weren't any to lose in the team. Right. Yeah, absolutely. Great team, great organization, great players, great coaches, very well prepared, all that kind of stuff. So, and that was a great test for us and a great challenge. We learned a lot about those, learned a lot about those situations and those things. Penalty kills, power plays, late calls, overtime, the score, you know, changing and the leads changing. Uh, that was great. Great experience for our guys, and and now we've had some of that experience, so we know what to do going forward next time. Our Yeah. Yeah, Outhouse, great game as always. He's, he's always there for us. He's a rock. Uh, tremendous player, tremendous athlete, tremendous teammate. And uh, he was what gave us a chance to win tonight for sure. Uh, three of your team's four goals came on the special teams, one shorthanded, the other two on the power play. How big a role did the special teams play in today's game? Yeah, a big role I think for both teams. You know, Tri-Cities at the end on the power play, tying it up, and then the, the game-winning goal in overtime. So uh, it's, it's a special teams. Um, the league, the, the emphasis in this league often is on special teams. That's often what wins games, and we saw that tonight for sure. First, first loss of the year, Dan. Just give or take a minute. Well, just really proud of, of what the team has done to this point in the year, and it's been through hard effort, hard work, and attention to detail to, to um, have success so far this year. Uh, but as far as the segment that we're in, we're one and one in the segment. Now we're going on the road for the next two games, and we just have to keep that short term focus. You guys were named the CHL number one ranked in the top ten. Does that add any pressure to your team or just continue business as usual? Yeah, no, we don't really look at that to be honest with you. It's just business as usual, staying inwardly focused, relying on each other, trusting our process, staying with our style of game. Bit of a tentative start there tonight? Uh, yeah, they uh, got a good team over there and they start every game uh, hard and fast and I just think we weren't ready for that and uh, we got to be ready to uh, start the game each and every night. and. Uh, if we do that, it'll be a lot different game for sure. One penalties for you guys in the game was lack of discipline, part of the reason you guys lost tonight? Yeah, definitely we want to keep it uh, three or less each game, and I think, uh, especially against a team like that, they have a lot of talent over there and a lot of guys that can put the puck in the net. I think if we stay more disciplined, uh, gives us a better chance to win. Kind of cost you in the end, didn't it? Uh, yeah, definitely. We uh, just kind of got tied up there, and that happens. We. Uh, this guy got to be better next game. Uh, next little run so far, first loss, and it came in over. Pretty good run for the team. Uh, yeah, we are uh, got off to a good start. I think we uh, got a good group in there, and we just come to the rink ready to play. But uh, tonight we didn't do that, and then next game we will be better. So we've got to focus on that and just get ready for the next one.